Hi everyone! And on this video, we are going to discuss or analyze how big data analysis have made difference to the companies. And here is my insight. Stay tuned! If we are going to say big data, that is actually huge. And if you, as a simple nursing student, you wouldn't know what really does it mean. Because this is really broad, especially if you are not into informatics. Technology really made our life different. And in fact, it is already part of our daily living. Not only part of our daily living, but it is part of our routine. We cannot work without cell phone. We cannot work without computer. Or we cannot even work without messaging our friends or taking step via Google search, right? But have you ever imagined how does everything done in the internet or how everything goes like this? And that is all because of big data. When we say data, these are the pertinent information that we give as consumers. And the big data is all where information goes. But do you have any idea how do marketers use this big data in order for them to excel? I'll tell you the answer. This is because of big data analysis. The world today has continuously growing big data sets. This large amount of data is being produced every minute by the business or the marketers, and of course, other informatic experts. Persisting such data requires advanced and analytic solutions. This is where the big data analytics comes in, which plays an indispensable role in analyzing big data to uncover information. So what is big data analytics? The big data analytics refers to a form of advanced analytics and helps excerpts a meaningful insight such as unexplored correlations, hidden patterns, market trends, and customer preferences. It involves complex applications and elements like predicted models, a statistical algorithm, and analysis of analytical data. There are a lot of advantages of this big data analytics that made difference to a lot of companies. The major difference is that improving the marketing and improve consumer satisfaction. The big data analytics gives us hint on how are we going to get the heart of our consumers. From a simple data that is being given by our consumers, marketers make this data into product, service, or improved operational things being done in a company. So if you can see, big data analytics actually helps businesses to grow. Actually, it's not only in the business world, but even in the healthcare. Through gathering or collecting the information from our consumers or from our patients, we can improve the services that we are providing them. And big data really helps the organization to excel and give an state-of-the-art service. There are a lot of advantages of this big data analytics. Number one, it improves customer experience. The data that the consumers give is being collected by the organization. Then, this is analyzed and understood. Certain things here that are being collected are behavior, preferences, and demands that makes our consumers happier. This collection of data helps our marketers compete and excel in the market. Through collection of data that are being given by the consumers, companies can do personalization demands which are being preferred or being suggested by the consumers. This uplift therefore the company and customer relationship. Once the company will go to listen on the customer's demand, of course, customers will be satisfied and they will keep coming in into that certain company or certain product. Next is it builds consumer loyalty. The big data analytics allows organization to actively build loyalty rather than just response to consumer queries. If the consumer were going to give, for example, their, their complaints and the organization will listen to these complaints and they're going to fill in the gaps or will going to give some solution to these gaps, they are already improving their service. And of course, if that is the case, consumers will keep coming into them which builds loyalty and trust. And of course, it improves the customer and company relationship. This thereby increases then the satisfaction of the consumers of their product. 
Another one is that big data pull out environmental trends that can be converted into products, service, or operational activities. Once these big data are analyzed, experts will going to see the demands of the consumers. Therefore, if they see something that can be improved or that can be released as a product or service, they will turn this collected data into a certain service or product that the consumer needs. Next one is that it tracks consumer behavior. Big data analytics constructively identify what is behind consumers' behavior. It allows to get personal choice of consumers and drives the quality of customer experience. So for example, on your phone, you are actually watching a movie that is related to healthcare, for example. That site, for example, will going to analyze those things that you are searching. Then after that, once you're going to go back on that site, it will give you the same topic that you've searched. It will already give you recommendations and that's how big data analytics see the trends of your behavior. Next one is data collection. Nowadays, every consumer search and voice messages or voice commands are all recorded. Therefore, in the era of digital marketing, many companies maintain profile with thousands of data points with each individual. Those things that you recorded will be stored in your program, for example, or in your unit. Another one is consumer retention. A data-driven customer experience is imperative in improving customer retention and increased satisfaction. Of course, if you are always going to listen on the demands of your customers or consumers, they will keep on coming back and they will be loyal to you. Therefore, it will improve your service and increase the satisfaction of your consumers. Another one is predictive analysis. With an optimized analytics, data can be monitored and can be useful, especially when it comes to determining what might interest the customer and the needs in the future. It helps the companies to get to know what might happen and they can prepare in the future. In this manner, they can prepare their responses already in advance and get ahead of the risk and influence the outcomes. So for example, there are some complaints given by the consumer. With this, the big data analytics will going to see what are the gaps, what are the trends, and what are those things that needed by the consumers in the future. In this manner, the organization can prepare solutions in order to solve some issues so that it will not happen next time. Also, they can prepare a predictive response that can answer some consumers that are already doubting or asking for more questions. With that kind of experience, big data analytics helps the leadership of the organizations to improve also. So for example, they are not already good in this product, of course, they will not pursue it. Otherwise, they're going to improve the product in order for the customers to stay. Therefore, with big data analytics, consumers are more convenient and they are more responsive to their preferences. In the side of healthcare, big data analytics helps the nursing leaders to decide or to improve their decision-making in just few clicks. Once they know that there is a risk in a certain nursing action, they can already prevent it. Therefore, this reduces complications to the side of patient or in the nursing field. There are a lot of good impacts of big data analytics and the most important thing is that it improves our customer satisfaction. It uplifts patient safety in the hospital. If you are speaking about healthcare, it gives convenience to the patients or to the customers. And more importantly, it makes our lives easier. Thank you so much for watching. And again, this is Charisse Doldulao. See ya. Bye.